Hey y'all, in this episode of Cast Chats, I am making over my back porch. It looks so good. Stay tuned. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Cass Bowers and this is Cass Chats. And it's been a long, long time. I'm looking at the wrong place, so I'm rusty. It's been a long, long time. I'm kind of back. Lots of things have happened. I'll do a, maybe I'll do an update. This other, other YouTubers do. I'm not a YouTuber though, because I still have like 22 subscribers, but you know, I'm back. I'm going to try to like really, really produce some content because... Sorry, because because of the things that have changed in my life, um, I really am gonna commit myself to doing this. Anyway, I'm about to go to brunch. You know, I love a good brunch, even though it's Saturday. I like to go to brunch on Saturdays because it's not as crowded. Um, but I want to do an unboxing because I'm going to redo my upstairs back patio, and I mean porch, porch patio, whatever it is. So I want to show you what I bought. So the first thing is I got this bamboo, fake bamboo from Menard. And as you can see, it even shows you how you can use it. So I'm gonna use it on my back porch. I bought two of these and um, it, was, it was on sale. So, oh, the thing's moving. You know, I always have camera issues. I got a new phone. And the phone is really super big and heavy. Eh, it's gonna keep falling. Hold on. All right, I kind of fixed it. I don't know why it's falling like that. Oh, and I will give you, I will have to give you an update on this wig, honey. This wig is, I call her Donna, as in Donna Summer. I love it, it's a love me hair wig. And we'll do that, I bought another one. I have four wigs, so I'll do a whole wig day with the four wigs that I have. Anyway, back to what I was saying. Super cheap, got it at Menards. It's going to be like the fencing around the back patio, and I'll show you that in a minute. Then I went to Big Lots. I don't know if you have, if, Big Lots is one of my favorite places to go. Oh, and I was looking for this other pack of lights, so good. I bought um, a set of lights to go around the patio. I always have to have lights. I love lights outside, but. Everything was 50% off. So this was 50% off, it's $12. So it was only $7, $6, $6. And then I got these pillows because the cushion that I have out there is this teal color and I bought these pillows to go with it. I think I'm gonna go back if they have any more and get some more because I think the sale ends tomorrow. So I think today I'm gonna go back and get some with designs. Cause I thought, there, I thought my cushion had a design, but it's a solid color. Look, it's exactly this color, the cushion I have on there now. So I'm gonna get more pillows. So I got three, three pillows, three of these to go out there. Um, and I put in there. And then I bought another <laughs> set of lights. These are also solar powered. And this is for the umbrella. I have three umbrellas out there right now in the backyard and I don't know I don't know what I'm gonna use how many of these I'm gonna use for the actual umbrella if I'm gonna use it for the back patio but I bought two two sets of these and these were ten dollars so they 50% off they were twenty dollars so I got two of those big lots what else from big lots um, I think that, oh these are so cute these are battery operated um these little ladders they're little lanterns, like, you know, there's a little candle in there. So um, just put the battery in and then it'll light it up. Lights of light. Lighting, you know, sets the moon. Um, so I got that one and that one. So let's sit these two out there on that back patio. I keep calling it a patio and I think it's a uh, porch. And then I got the little ties when I went to Menards for that fencing to kind of tie it onto the railing. Um, then we moved on to Target. This dress is from Target. It's so cute. Also on sale. I don't know what the price was. Went to Target and got this pretty dress. Like, all of this unboxing doesn't have to do with my back video, but look how pretty it is. It's so pretty. Um, extra large dress, Target. I tried it on already. It's super cute. And then I got this hat. I have this black dress similar to this that I want to wear this with. And I fell in love with it. It's so cute. 
it's so cute it does, it's not cute the way i just put it on but i haven't ha worn a hat haven't been a hat person in years but i think i'm gonna be a hat person again so there's that then of course i had to get some citronella candles because i love candles so much blue and yellow you know i love some blue and yellow together so these are the, the three dollar candles from target and they're all citronella, so I can sit out there and not have to worry about mosquitoes. And I bought four of those, so two yellow and two um, blue. And then I always buy these little these little candles from Target. It says, plants are my soulmate. This is lavender. Lavender is one of my favorite scents for calming. It makes me feel like I'm in the spa. So $3. I always go through the $3 section at Target and buy things. And then I bought, just bought some command strips to go with the, I mean, this is what saved my walls. Now I'm able to put things on the wall. So I have another painting to put in my bedroom. I'll show you that when I do my bedroom cleanup because it's like a mess in here right now. And then I stopped at Hobby Lobby. Well, my mom wanted to go to Hobby Lobby. I'm not really a fan of shopping there or there at all. But then I walk in and I find this. <gasps> this is so cute. So, of course, I bought it. I don't know how much it costs. It costs $18. Got that one. And then this one. You know, I'm a plant girl. Just keep growing. Isn't that so cute? I don't know where I'm going to put it. I don't know if I'm going to put them in here, in my bedroom, in my office, maybe the downstairs bathroom. I don't know. I have no idea. I just saw them, loved them, and got them, which is my theme lately. See it, love it, buy it. See it, love it, buy it. I should have a series just on that, right? So that was my unboxing for the back hallway. Hallway. The back porch. And let me show you the back porch. The before of the back porch. One second. All right. Here is the back porch. Um, it's kind of drizzling, raining out here a little bit. Here's the back porch. So this is a before. I am looking for a rug. To replace this and I haven't found one yet so when I redo it I'll probably just redo it and then put the rug in later and that's the cushion I was telling you about it matches really well with the pillows that I bought that little table over there has a marble top I don't know where I got that from I think I got that from Big Lots last year and then as you can see I had my little plant that died but then I just replaced it by putting candles in there those are citronella candles um so but I have to protect my my furniture because there's an animal that's been chewing on it you see that probably squirrels my mom said they don't like cayenne so i'm gonna spread it with some cayenne pepper and see if that makes them go away um but anyway this is the little area let me go over here so you can see the other side so it's not that big i measured it it's about eight by four or eight and a half by five actually is the size of the porch but it's a cute little porch to just sit and, you know, kind of chill out. It's really sunny normally sitting here. So this is like an evening time, which is why I have all the lighting. And you kind of get a, a sneak peek of my patio downstairs. But yeah, this is the upstairs porch. I like to sit up here at night because I don't like rodents. <laughs> when I say rodents, I mean like possum and raccoons that come through my yard because I have all that greenery that bushy area and it just seems like they come through there I don't know if they do or not I've never seen one I'm just assuming because I hear rough I still hear like some rustling in the in the it could just be the wind but I get so jittery that I'm like mm, I gotta go upstairs so when there's people with me I'll sit down on the patio but most of the time I am sitting up here where it's nice and safe and yeah, that is, this is the before. Tune back in for the after. Just sweeping and cleaning up the porch. It was a mess. And I think I want to paint the porch um, floor. But for now, I just cleaned it. And yeah, I did pick up the debris that I dumped over the side.
you. There's a gap over there, though. Look. There's a gap. You gotta fill the gap somehow. I love it. It looks so cute. The rug definitely has to go. I think I'm gonna throw it over the side right now. So I need to get a rug that looks better. But otherwise than that, I like it. It looks so cute. Maybe some lights on that side. And then, um, yeah, this rug has to go. And there's a gap. The gap bothers me. So I think I need to just stretch the bamboo out and it won't have a gap, but I'm scared to do that. So I'm gonna wait for my mom for that, but it looks good. And there you have it, there's the after. Um, I took the rug from downstairs and brought it up here and I think it looks great. I think I might, I don't know if I like the pillow arrangement, but right there I'm gonna get some bamboo leaves. I mean, elephant ear leaves or palm tree leaves to put in there to fill that hole and then tonight I can't wait for the lights to come on and that's it and when I'm sitting here I'll give you the view when it's dark and I'm sitting here yes it'll be so nice I did have some citronella candles that I was going to put out here but I decided to build all this bamboo and because I'm like a little fire cautious, we're just going to do the ones that light up and then do, um, you know, some battery operated candles instead. Anyway, this is the final product. So happy with it.